Are you gonna eat that? Your ice cream. It's melted. Um, you wouldn't want to be eating ice cream soup or something, right? Or milkshake or whatever you call that. I'm sorry, that was rude. No, don't be. I kind of forgot I was having some. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry for your loss. Excuse me? You just look dressed for the occasion. I mean, you don't see a guy dressed in a black suit at a park often, right? I mean, of course, unless you're an undercover spy or something, but... <laughs> uh, you clearly seem like you don't want to be bothered. I don't even know why I'm still here. I'm sorry no, I, don't for be. the way I was at... You just... He caught me off on. guard. Yeah, I could tell. <laughs> you sure do crack a lot of jokes. I'm Jenna, by the way. <laughs> I'm Jonah. Going. What was her name again? What would she be up to on her 23rd birthday? <laughs> Probably bragging about a new job. IBM's all she used to talk about anyway. Ooh, seems like she had her shit together. <laughs> yeah, always on top of it. I think that's what I liked about her. Her being the way she was. I thought that it might help me find myself. <laughs> Look where we are now. You don't need someone else to help you find yourself. You have control over your own life. <laughs> yeah, but there was something so intriguing about her. Like, when we first met. She was so intellectual, so passionate about 
everything. It just makes you, makes me want to feel alive again. And And that was only the first half of our relationship. What was the other half? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Making a wish for Maggie. You're disgusting. <laughs> I have a better idea. You do know you can't smoke with that, right? But you can make a wish with it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mind me asking what happened with you guys? What do you mean? What was the other half of your relationship? Hey, it's okay, it's just us. I thought I knew Maggie completely, but it turns out I was wrong. What? What the fuck was... Please don't tell me I hit a deer. Max? You didn't hit a deer. Must have been some other animal, right? I think it's better if you come out here. Holy shit! Is she dead? Did you even check? See for yourself. No. No. No, this can't be happening. Fuck! We need to go! We need to go no, now! No, Maggie, we can't... Jonah, we can't leave her like this! If we go to the police and they find out I was responsible for this... You know I have so much going for me! Are I you seriously worried about yourself right now, Maggie? You just hit someone! We just hit someone! If you didn't drag my attention away from the road, this wouldn't have happened! Stop it! Both of you! Jonah's right! We can't just leave her here! Ash, come on! You know how important this is for me! Max, just... Calm down. I can fix this for you. What are we gonna do? We're just gonna bring her back from the dead? You can't fix this! Well, yeah, no Ash. shit! Just let me do this, okay? First, I need you to take care of her, okay? Maggie had her ways of influencing people in the best and worst ways. I found that attractive until I ended up as one of her victims. She made me believe that I killed whoever she was. And that I was responsible for that night. Sure. I dragged her attention away from the road, no. but... Jonah, don't start with that. It wasn't your fault. She never deserved you. And now she'll never have me. Never deserved her. 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 She never deserved you. Ash. Hi. Hi. 
can we talk? I'm sorry, I'm really busy right now. I know you're not busy at 9 p.m., so just let me in. All right. You know what day it is, right? Yeah, I know. What about it? I want to talk about her. Everything's been so weird since the accident. The girl we hit, now Maggie? No, that's in the past. Why bring it up now? I feel like you should have just moved on. No, how can I move on? The fact that she died right after it happened? You don't mind that strange? Okay, why are you bringing this up to me? It's not like I had anything to do with it. Cut the bullshit, Jonah. I'm here because I know you had something to do with her death. going with this. The night before Maggie's business trip, you invited her here, remember? According to her, you wanted to host a dinner, you know, just to wish her luck. And it turns out you didn't. Mags never came home, her suitcase was never moved, and you were the last person to see her. Asking me that right now? This. This is why. You think covering up her murder wasn't fucked up enough, even getting blamed for it? You loved her, John. Everybody thinks they know everything. And you? You don't know shit about us. Have you ever felt so mistreated? So controlled? Like everything is your fault? I was just tired of her running her fucking mouth. And one day I snapped. What the hell did you do? I just want to know what you did to my friend. You know, believe it or not, I didn't mean to. anything with that, right? If you do remember, it was your idea to hide the body. So you're just as guilty as me. I'm not going to the police. It's for my safety. What? You don't think I'm gonna hurt you, do you? You killed your own girlfriend. I don't see you having a problem killing me. Like I said, it was an accident. Where do we go from here? <laughs>